So guys, you want to head over to search and type in system configuration. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on boot and then you want to click on advanced options. So now once you're on this, you want to head over to search and type in calculator. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to tick maximum memory and then you want to select the amount of memory that you have. So for example, if you have eight gigabytes of RAM, you want to type in on a calculator 1024 times eight and then click on enter. And now you want to type in the number that comes up here. Now instead, if you have four gigabytes of RAM, you want to type in 1024 times four, click on enter. And then you want to type in this number into here. I'll do one more example. If you have 16 gigabytes of RAM, you want to type in 16 times 1024, click on enter. You want to type in this number into here. So whichever amount of RAM that you have, you want to times it by 1024 and then type in the number right here. If you want to know how much RAM you have, you want to head over to search and type in task manager. Click on it and then click on the performance tab and then you'll see right here how much memory you have in total. Now once you've done this, you want to click on OK and then click on OK again and then click on exit without restart. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search and type in view advanced system settings. Click on it. You want to make sure that you're on the advanced tab and then under performance, you want to click on settings and then you want to click on the advanced tab right here again. And now under virtual memory, you want to click on change and then you want to uncheck this right here. Uncheck this. And now once you've done that, you want to tick no paging file, click on OK, click on OK again. And now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.